Stop that right there. <laughs> I mean, the Primal Beast does a good job at doing what we mentioned, right? Which is TPing in and protecting the Terror Blade. Oh, okay, there we go. That's what we want. Pandas I mean, Antares might just be dead. Okay, he's got the TP. All right. Should be all right. He'll be okay. But look, like, immediately, they have to be very careful of their positioning because they didn't take it level the one. Win! A win! Solo kill! Uh -oh. All right, I mean... Solo is making the move down, so it's very similar to last time. Here they come. They should get there at you here. The Ink Swell setup comes in. They do. Take him down. See if we can help find anything in return. Get the dead shot over towards Antares. But Solo and Miro, they'll turn towards Tofu, ready to continue the dive. Fairy Fire from Antares keeps him alive for now. Stick charges from Tofu. Won't save him. He still ticks out. Wait, Quinn's here. He turns up. Okay, does get a cleanup kill. Won't be able to find more. Solo. He got the kill. They got that successful move, but everything went downhill from there. Top. Ace. They'll be able to Good punish to by the looks of it. The two of them. Nice kill. Solo back towards the top lane. Great moves. So Grab on me. He's already level six. I guess this four, level four talk. spirit breaker. They've got the silence. His kid tacker able to charge out. Gets oh, it off, man. but he doesn't get any distance as Quinn takes him out once again. And just have that sort of setup for the information. Up top again. DD. They're going on ace. They'll get him Got again. It. Nicely done. Straight in the ball. If, if anyone started to threaten them, they don't even get the chance to. Immediately takes them out. He says, thank you very much. So Top lane. Back in one more. Top. Oh, actually moving over towards the mid here with a charge for a key attack on towards Ace. This time the dead shot Tofu. Excellently aimed. It doesn't matter. Got Ramsey is still able to step back in. Finish Ace off. More kills for Ramsey. You know, at the least they're, they're, they're killing taking Ace. the stack. Another one. They certainly <laughs> are. Antares will try and see what he can do here from the side. But Quinn, he's got this haste rune. He's easily out of there. They got Mira, a charge. They're going to... Well, looks of like itself for Celery. They have the charge forward onto the Phoenix. This will allow Quinn to continue to create the distance. Oh, they I mean, missed Celery, the stroke. I mean, they've got to still get him, surely. They yeah, blood, blood grenades grenade. are out. It's a All bit right. sloppy, but the kills are kill. But exactly where he is, Tofu. Can he get the angle? Oh, smoke dispels. They see him. Ram sees he's not aware. He's in trouble. And there's going to be no chance of getting over to help out, surely there, there's a TP coming in. Way too much damage. You can't stop this from happening. But they're ready to fight. Oh, yeah. That is, they've got the four of them, Quinn. He's ready to start things off, goes straight over towards Miro. They'll turn with the ult, they've got the soul by now, and the two of them silence as well. Double, Double Doom will be there. But is it going to be But Quinn's enough? perfectly fine, the super no cap, they can't hit the end. They've got to run, they've got to split here, Nine Pandas. Key attacker, he doesn't make it away. Duracho takes it down, Miro turns with the TP, but Stanley fights him. And Solo, he's likely going to get chased too. He's got a charge. They've got the burn. As Solo, he'll try and run. Pig pole as well hit. As he's in on top of him, the dead shot comes through. It's three kills for Gaming Gladiators. His nine pandas attempt completely shut down. And it's coming in. Okay, I mean, they. I, I feel like that's the best way to get killed. They want to kill Ace again. The game. You know, so far the game plan has been just kill this bristle back. And they should have him again. They will once more. But here comes the squad. Oh, indeed. Gaming. Here comes the revenge attempt from Gaming Gladiators, and they'll turn up. Antara is on the retreat, but Quinn will go forward. Got the illusion run as well, still gets hold in by the overgrowth. Quinn's kind of alone. They get the angle, they get the soul bind out. Just kidding. He's still able to stand his ground with the old Quinn grabs Ramsey, slams him into the ground. They're having to head back under the tier two. There's nothing else that Nine Pandas can throw back at Gaming Gladiators. They Ramses. Stepping up, but he has a lot of backup. It's nine pounds they're smoked up, they're ready to go. So fine in a double doom once again. They're gonna try and focus Ace. Ramses puts the big game to the top goes towards Miro off the grab there. Quinn grabs Ramses and slams him out of the game. They now Miro. Kill Ace. They've lost the two of them, but Quinn he's ready to try and clean up more response because he goes for it, takes Miro down. Kiyotaka will manage to escape. What a name. Duraccio. And he's going to be able to help out and look towards taking down poor old Antares here. Metamorphosis from Duraccio, the control from Tofu. Kill to be found. Hey, ground. It's pressure on multiple fronts. Look, Quinn and Celery, they're set up on mid for Miro while they're pushing bottom. He just opens up straight away on a Miro. Goes into the tier two. The burn of the summary, bringing Miro down low. Can he get up the high ground? He can't. Right. Tofu shoots him down. My gaming's just, they're, again, they're just punishing the greedy Ramses. He's getting chased down by Ace! The He's gone! going to save him, dying oh under his God. own tier three! It's happening again, Owen. They're going to knock on the doors. It's 19 minutes! Quinn, got their combo. Can they land the big dooms? They're going to try. Instant Yules from Celery. And at that point, you have to just back off. They're already in with a the grab. They just caught Key Attacker. He's, He's dead. dead! 48 seconds! No buyback on him! They still have Egg at the ready, too. They can't commit into this fight on Nine Pandas. Uh-oh. 
This Rax. I mean, whatever happens, it's they lasted trouble. longer than 20 minutes this time. That's true. It's something, not look, a lot. Meta's back up because he had that arcane rune from earlier. Ace. I mean, he's ready to dive. He's four. killing Miro at the tier four. Oh my god. Oh. Good god. No mercy from gaming today. There are those tier twos on the other lanes, though. That's the so thankful that's thing. So that's the thing. You're like, it's all right, guys. We can only lose one set of racks at this point. I'm We're sure that's... tier twos in the other lane, so... Uh, I'm sure that's not what they're saying. <laughs> it's dead too fast. And at this point, I don't know if they want to take a fight outside of the base. They might just have to go full retreat here. They do put vision down. Do they want to go for this, though? I mean, they see Celery. They see three heroes. They're going to They're going to go for it. Again, in with the opening. Charge across as well. Two tanky heroes, they should have just taken out Zenu, they got the overgrowth as well. Here come They'll take the Phoenix now. They put the BKB in the god strength, look towards Duracho, Duracho. That's sort of settled himself into a worse situation there. He gets completely surrounded, but he has got the Aegis, so he's happy to sacrifice himself the once. They turn over towards Ace, a lot oh of damage God, Ray, careful. They kill Ace off, but they're left so low. Key attackers out of the game, Ramses has to run. That is quite some building damage coming out. And not a lot, not a lot coming pandas. from Nine Pandas. Not a lot at all. Tier 1's still standing in a solid spot. I mean, even that, in that game 1, did they take a Tier 1? I don't believe so, no. Uh, maybe they did end up taking the bottom Tier 1, but yeah, just barely. That was it. Uh, they're knocking on Tier 4's. And Nine Pandas, they kind of just have to watch because they don't I have mean, their spells up. The thing Gaming Gladiators to know that they've, they've kind of got nothing yep. to, to throw at them. And Ace with Boots of Travel pushes in the top wave a little bit too and rejoins his team. Meta's still halfway. Doom, 20 seconds. God Strength, it's coming back up. Man, they gotta just try. But Tier gaming, four's going down. They just back off. They're like, okay, we got what we came for. The cold are coming back up. Go for outside of vision. Charge. Instantly stopped from that Straight ward. Up into the air. The silence is out upon them. They'll turn, they'll get the grab immediately onto Miros. He's out of the game. It's all on him. No buybacks available. And they Ramsey. try and get Topher, they don't even get him. Topher's still alive. Finally, the charge of Key Attacker comes in to take him down. But they cannot fight here against the remainder of Gaming Gladiators as Ramsey's caught by the Nasal Goo. Gaming Gladiators is surrounding the Sven. Key Attacker trying to help out with the charge across, but it's Quinn who comes crashing across the two of them. Ramsey's to fall. Three dead on Gladiators. Just such clean oh, plays. Only two on Gladiators. Only two on Gladiators, but I hate that little ward, right? They put a little ward from Topo, they see the charge coming in, they stop the initiation. They see everything. Nice. The are still chased. They actually get the dead shot angle onto Ramsey. As he still has popped the god strength. Looking to catch them off guard, I guess. I mean, considering this. trying to fight. Maybe if the, the, the Silver Edge hit onto Ace, they could open up onto something, but it's going to come to an end. Ramses can't close the gap. He's going to go in with the jump now. Uh, instantly Yules. But no availability for the break, so Ace is perfectly fine. It's BKB a BKB has to, to come run. Out Ramses, and he has to go full retreat right now. Oh, it's a disaster. As Nine Pandas not finding the jump that they were trying for. Ramses. Ramses, he may still get caught. Ooh. He's got to keep running. The Quills, the Goo coming out from Ace. Solo, he attempts for a TP out. Quinn finds him immediately in the trees. Solo's out of the game. And Tara is gone as well. Both supports down. Maybe it's just this desperation. Ramsey's trying to catch gaming off guard, but have to come out. They're going for Tofu. It's been a tricky one to find. The Bash is dead. The Tofu Another Yule. With the Yule. Silence the dead shot. Doesn't uh. matter. Ramses will get the kill. But the Rax. They're, they're being taken out. Ace Stretcher on with a full push stop. The three tanky beasts with triple Lincolns in there. He's in, but uh, was that a doom on an it's illusion? It's a doom on an it illusion. Wasn't, it was a doom on an illusion. Uh, the supernova's out. They, they can't, can't hit it. This egg. Mirror's out of the game. The, the base, it, it's in shambles. The third set of wrecks taken out. Mega creeps are there for gaming gladiators. They're trying their best to hold on nine pandas, but at this point, very little that can be done to give them a chance of turning this one as the tier fours under threat. Queen goes in, takes out Solo, he's out for good. Ramses tries for the double, the Lotus Can't is there even finish and just stunning off. himself. Queen comes in with the grab. GG. It's all over. GG is called. Gaming wow. Gladiators today completely crushing nine pandas. Both games back to back, folks. This wasn't even close today. No. We had what, a little bit of an early game kind of stuff that they were getting some trade a very stuff little for nine pandas, but a very little bit. You know, they have. It's a little deceptive, too, because you look and they're like, oh, they're not that behind on gold. But when they're going Midas Octarine and they're still behind on gold, 
Yeah, you can tell gaming, they feel super comfortable. An excellent game plan, everything ended up working out for them, and honestly, Quinn, he was unbelievable this game. Uh, he was. Start to finish. You gotta watch out for this Primal Beast coming out again from oh, Quinn yeah. down the line in this tournament. 5-0-21, absolutely crushed the mid-matchup, and uh, knew exactly what to do. Everything after that point was completely covered, and the fact that in those early moments, sure, they were killing Ace on this Bristleback, but it really didn't seem like that was any sort of issue for Gaming Gladiator's game plan. They had the stacks prepared. Ace was able to easily catch up on any gold he was leaving, losing out on due to these deaths. It just didn't matter at all, those oh. early kills on him. And the time that you're spending killing Ace, Doraccio's like, all right, great. Yep. I've got all the freedom in the world as a Terror Blade. Weren't able to take advantage of the grim Doom lane besides that one time that they were able to get Doraccio overall gaming. Today, looking way too good, especially when they're able to play these tempo drafts versus the green. Absolutely. When you see gaming playing like this in the lower bracket, you can definitely feel that they're going to be zooming all the way through it and going pretty deep in this tournament, if Absolutely. not just all the way, if they could continue to bring out this consistent level uh, of just complete crushing uh, with these sort of games. Nine Pandas, an unfortunate series for them to go out on right. This is a team yeah. that we've seen great stuff from, but here today against gaming gladiators, it, it just felt like they been completely sold by, they had by Game number. Gladiators. They knew exactly what to do against them. Yep, they shut down the early game, and maybe those bands, you know, Neo Tsunami was talking about them, asking CY, maybe they do have a bit of a read of how they want to deal with these teams' early games. So, to see how people adjust versus Gaming Gladiators. Absolutely. Gaming Gladiators, incredible performance here today, as they were not slowed down at all. Two very quick games against Nine Panners will secure Gaming Gladiators the ability to continue moving on here in the lower bracket. It might not have been as fast as that first game of the series, but it was just as dominant, Lacoste. Yeah, I told you it was not going to be a 20-minute game. I mean, the way this game started, Quinn gets the first blood and just snowballs out of control. Gaming Gladiator is also a team that knows how to punish this greedy style. This has been their bread and butter, uh, building all these auras and then just going together. Bristleback was in the pool, available, so they do switch things around in the end and uh, still get the hands on Bristle, making so many stacks. One thing I like about this team is they're so efficient. You can see them while Bristleback is farming the stacks, the rest of the team is smoked, going through the area where Bristle is farming, protecting him, and also using the scan, finding Sven, getting the kill on him. So they're just so good.